Hello there, this is Electro Tekken here with a new video. Um, I'm going to be talking about the error 0x807003. Um, you get this error in Windows 7 and it's mostly due to your libraries or a missing file or folder to say. So I have encountered this problem in my music folder and actually the music library and as you can see it includes three locations let's click on that so we have my music public music and this unknown album so here's the problem and what where it occurs let's click new folder and we're getting this error right here new folder error an unexpected error is keeping you from creating the folder if you want if you continue to receive this error you can use the error code to search for help with this problem. Error, and here's the error value. The system cannot find the path selected. Can't um, try again because it can't find it. So it cancel. So this um, stops you from creating a new um, folder. Mm, I don't think it stops you from playing music as much, but surely it stops you from creating the folder. So. We want to fix this error, so it's really simple. Now remember, a music library or any library consists of different locations. So let's right click on the music folder or library and go to properties. Or we can right click or we actually click includes here. So as you can see, I have my music, public music and unknown album. And the unknown album has a check mark to it. That means it's the set safe location. So, let's go back to the folder here, the library. As you can see, we have those three libraries right here. And notice, this folder is unavailable when you click on the folder. Usually it would show you what's in the folder when you drop down the arrow. But when you drop down the arrow, it's saying this folder is unavailable. So, that's the source of our error right there. It cannot find this file to save the new folder to. That's why we're receiving this error. So what we're going to do, we're going to click on the locations. Sorry, we're going to go to the right click music and properties. Oh, sorry about this. Okay, so since this folder isn't located, we're going to remove it. Or you can just click restore defaults. But I wouldn't recommend this if you added um, some folders into your collection. So we're going to click on the problem folder and we're going to remove it. And it automatically sets it back to the default My Music folder. And then we're going to click Apply and OK. And now our location for that unsaved area is deleted and we have two locations. So let's go to My Music. So we want to create a new folder now. We're going to click New Folder and there we go. Our area is complete. Thank you for watching. Hope this video helps a lot of people. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you.